Someone should check back there. I'll do it. I want this whole area sealed off. Yes, sir. If there's anything here, we're gonna find it. When's the last time this thing was serviced? This is rusty. Don't get distracted, Mendez. What are we looking for here? Anything that moves. Anything that doesn't. They still didn't find that relic. I'd love to be the guy that does. Not me. Why not? I'll be a hero. I'll be dead, more likely. No thanks. I'll keep sitting here looking for hostiles. Less talking, more looking, gentlemen. Get off your asses. Yes, sir. What's your team doing? I'll check. We're not paying them to sightsee. We'll have to go under. Yeah. We know there's a moon temple. What we're looking for is any smaller ruins Wait. we might have missed before. Okay. It's really wet in there. I'm afraid if we move it, we'll lose it. We're gonna have to reinforce the bridge. It'll be tough. Why didn't you test the bridge like I told you? Oh, I'm pretty sure we did test the bridge first. Fuck off. I'm not covering for you. Maybe we can pull it out. Okay, maybe. Let me think about that. We can take them. You go left. I'll take these guys. What in God? Hide. Hey, Sammy. Guys, I told them to test the bridge first. Son of a... Hey, hey, we're taking casualties. No, you don't! <laughs> means it's healing. I might have liked it better when it was injured. Oh, I know. I'm just trying not to think about my back. Yeah. That did it. Monuments or mountains or streams? I suppose we'll know it. Yeah. Mm, impossible. I can't carry any more. I see people down there. Hope they're friendly. I'll let you do the talking. Ugh. 
Hi. Do you know if there's a place nearby we can stay for the night? How'd you get so deep into the jungle? You lose your tour group or something? <laughs> no. There were some guys here before, looking for artifacts. You with them? Trinity. Definitely not. Uh, I need a break anyway. Come with me. Oh. I'm sorry to ask so many questions, but the only B&B in town is my place. Well, you can't be too careful. By the way, I'm Jonah. Abby. Lara. Come in, have a seat. Carlos, three. So, what are you here for exactly? Well, we were following a riddle when our plane went down. You mean it crashed? Yeah. <laughs> and you just walked out of the crash? Uh, well, you know, it's cruising pretty low. We are looking for Maya ruins. Maya, you know you're in Peru, right? Yes. Yeah, long story. Oh. Thanks. Well, you don't seem like a typical archaeologist. Oh, she's the archaeologist. I'm, I'm just a cook. Really? Yeah. Have you tried any of our local ceviche yet? It's a specialty. <laughs> Not unless it grows in the jungle. No. Don't tell me you missed our famous fish trees. <laughs> Where did you take this? Um, Mexico. Why? No, oh, I've seen this symbol before. Wow. There are some ruins nearby, and a small rock with something like this carved on it. Do you mind if I take a look around? Oh, be my guest, but I guarantee they're not Mayan. My people were Inca and proud of it. Oh, uh, uh, why don't you rest for a while? Are you sure? I promised you a day off. Well, I'm not gonna say no to that. Have fun. You too. Hmm. So, are you... Friends, uh, colleagues. She's brilliant. So, you're not... No, <laughs> nothing like that. New here, eh? Get used to doing a lot of nothing. Although drinking and sweating helps to break up the day. You're not a local? No, I work a ship that blew into some rocks just outside town. Storm came out of nowhere, sunk the damn thing. You want to make a deal? Huh. Ah, hello. Are you here with the excavation team? No, just passing through. Okay. If you need anything, the market's in the middle of town. You can resupply before you move on. Thank you. My pleasure. Two years have been working up to never to ask her out. I finally do, and now? Who is that guy anyway? Kuakiaku, just ask me. Are you the local tour guide? Mm, I know where to go, and who to steer you clear of. I see. Best fish is on the dock, obviously. Tacos are best at El Licor de Cerdo, but his beer is piss warm. <laughs> I'll watch out for that. Oh, and Omar, stay away from that guy. You don't need his kind of trouble. Thinks he can just come to town and take what he wants. Right. Well, I'll be sure to keep an eye out for trouble. <laughs> keep them both open. Thank God. The storm barely affected the village. The epicenter was closer to the plane. But it could have been much worse. What have I done? 
What if the earthquake hits here? Hundreds of people will die. I need to find a way to stop it. Omar, uh -huh. they've been working all night. And? Isn't that what they're paid for? Get lost. It's all- Shit, no. Now fuck off and let me watch the damn game. What is that? Piss off, you're spoiling the reception. Sure would be great to get these thieves out of here. Everything all right? No, it's all terrible, as usual. These pillagers come to town, Hire us to dig up our own relics, don't even pay us a living wage. And then they run off with them and profit. We are all desperate here. There's no work since poor Veneer pulled out. We're sitting ducks. And I imagine the storm hasn't helped matters. <laughs> what little we had is gone or underwater. I don't know what to do anymore. I have some experience with these kinds of people. Maybe I can help. I don't know what good it'll do. Did I catch your name? Lara. I'm Victor. If you want to talk to Omar, the executive lead tormentor in charge of theft and pillaging, he's in there. Thanks. Be careful. He doesn't like to be challenged. Piss off, you sport. Omar? Who are you? Looking for work? Um. Well, you're out of luck. We have enough people. Marco's in charge of HR now, anyway. Oh, uh, yes, thank you. Do you know where he is? Where else? The bar. Sites are dangerous, Marco. Anything can happen. I'm looking for Marco. Why? For what? I just want to talk to him. He doesn't want any trouble. I'm not looking for trouble. I'm looking for work. Work? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, sure. So, you're Marco? Tell me Omar didn't send you here to mess with me. If any of those animals hurts my son, I'll... Marco, I'm not with Omar. Believe me. What's this about your son? 
<sighs> I blew out my knee, so Omar took Pablo to replace me at the dig site. Said I was HR now and that it was my job to find a replacement. Otherwise... Otherwise he'd keep working your son. Yeah. I'm worried he's just gonna keep Pablo up there, even if I bring him someone. Well, it's a good thing you've just hired someone. You? Really? You, you do that? We wouldn't want to disappoint the boss, would we? Thank you. If you see Pablo, please tell him I'm here. What is that? Oh my uh. god. Please, help me. Are you okay? They're coming after me. Are you Pablo? Yes. It's okay. Your father sent me. He's at Abby's. Go meet him there. I'll take care of these guys. Thank you. Thank you so much. Get out of here. here even worth it. They are on the black market. True. Almost 100% markup. Where'd he go? Gotta investigate. Keep within a couple of yards of each other. She doesn't have a chance. This isn't right. I need more eyes on this. Oh, 
right. Need to get back to the village. Gather your things, I go back to the village. Bless you. Running toward Abyss. Good, I hope he's okay. Haven't seen you around here before. I just got in, but I won't be staying long. <laughs> Don't let how it looks fool you. This is a good place. Difficult, but good. Your garden seems to have survived the storm. Hmm. Luck and hard work. A lot of people pitched in to grow it, so they all came to protect it too. Pablo told me what you did. I... I don't know what to say, apart from thank you. Of course. You know, many years ago when my grandfather was still a boy, men came here and tried to cut down the wilderness around the village. Everyone was afraid to stand up to them, except my grandfather. A 15-year-old boy with an empty gun stood on the edge of the village and held back machines and men twice his size. Sometimes the courage of one person can outweigh the cowardice of dozens. I still have the gun he used to hold them back. I'd like you to have it, as a symbol of courage and my gratitude. Don't you want to give that to Pablo? My boy wants to be a doctor, like his mother. Say, what's your name anyway? Lara. I'll have a new story to tell now, Lara. Thanks again. I don't know how they can gossip so cheerfully, when we've lost so much. I'm sorry. Wait, you're not Mariela. No, I'm just, uh, so sorry to bother you. How are you? I think I can help you. Excellent choice. Enjoy. 
Excellent choice. I'm always ready to do business. Jonah, I found Incan ruins, but I think the foundation of the temple is older. Yeah, Abby remembered where she saw that symbol. It's inside the temple somewhere. Great. Tell her thank you for me. I'm right here. You can thank me by not breaking anything. <laughs> I'll be right there, Lara. I can hear them calling from under the earth. The voices. The old gods. Maybe you just need to rest. No. See for yourself. See where the breath of the gods rises from the womb of the earth. Listen to their pained howls. I have noticed that. Where is this breath? You'll see. You'll hear it. Perhaps you can ease their suffering. Hey, looks a lot bigger on the outside. What'd you do? <laughs> Turn a look. Eshel and Shakshal, the twins come together. What is it? Laura, I... What? Abby said not to break anything. I'm not breaking it. I'm restoring the original. Someone was trying to hide it. <clears throat> the twins come together before following the path of the living. It's been tampered with. Like that thing in Mexico. This must lead to the next clue. Go. I'll stay here. See what else I can find. <sighs> Sounds good. the temple. Great! Damn. Trinity already there, trying to blast their way in. I'm gonna take a closer look. 